Hey guys, welcome to another video. So first off, I want to thank our sponsors over at Slick Wraps. They sent us a nice package to review here for their new Slick Wraps for the iPad Air. So we're going to get into this and see what they sent us. Ooh, they sent us a little wood grain one. All right. And it looks like that's it. So they sent us a the wood version for the iPad Air. And uh, if you haven't heard of Slicks Wraps, head over to the website. They're, they're really a great company. Great products. And it'll give you a little bit of protection for your iPad. So we've got a screen protector because you've got to have the front protected. And it will go right in the center like that, like so. And then you've got the sides and they've even got the cutout for the um, for the sensors up top and I think that's a really nice thing so it's gonna go on just like that we're gonna go ahead and apply this and you get the back which fully covers the iPad it leaves the opening for the camera the mic everything this is gonna be a really nice wrap Think they're going to be really impressed with this if you were to get this and you've got your authentication card right here you can scan that and make sure and you've got the slick wraps um, soft bag here to clean up your device before using so we're going to cut for a second clean up the area and we're going to get this applied guys we'll be right back okay so the first part we're going to apply is the front so um, remember to head over to slickwraps.com you'll see this one there reasonably priced and it's very, it's uh, the quality of this uh, wrap is, I got to admit, it's not like every other wrap that I've come across that I've used for phones and other things. This is a wood grain texture and it feels almost leathery. It feels really good. And it's definitely premium. So one thing you want to do before applying this is you definitely want to clean your device. And they give you a nice um, slick wrap, slick wraps cloth that you can actually reuse for other things for just cleaning your device. So we're going to clean off the front of this here along the edges where we're going to be applying it. Remember guys, you got to give a shout out to the sponsors of these um, products because they do a lot to, to bring us great products and they work hard. So you want to make sure you head over to the website and purchase if you're interested in buying a wrap for your iPad and I definitely recommend it. So how I'm going to apply this, I'm going to apply this just like any other um, application I would apply, uh, like a screen protector or something like that. I'm going to apply it the same way. So you just want to be careful when you're doing this because you get one chance, but these are reusable, so just make sure you take your time with it. And if I'm blocking the camera, it's just for a second so I can line this up. So before actually pulling, you want to make sure that your device is lined up. So you can clearly see there that I took a second and I made sure it was right on the edges and everything looks good. I'm pulling a little hard. And you can test it by turning on the screen for a second to see. And then you just pull it right on off and you come on down and you can line this up afterwards. Remember, this isn't like a permanent seal. This is definitely a great protector for you. So it's a little crooked on that side. So all you got to do is pop it up as long as you've got the area cleaned up nice. It's got a cutout here. I forgot to mention it does have a cutout for the button here. And remember, this is all you can get this on and off very easy. Thanks to Slick Wraps for making it such an easy way to apply this and look at how nice that makes this iPad look. Wow, that is just gorgeous. Wood grain look on here feels really, really nice, really solid. And don't forget, they even give you a screen protector that goes right in the front right here. Perfect. Uh, Slick Wraps really did a great job with this. I'm impressed with it. So, I'm going to take a break and set up for the back. I'll put the, I'll put the screen protector on once we have the back. The back might be a little bit more complicated for some, but if you remember, if you just take your time and be patient with it, make sure it's clean, make sure you've got it all right, you will see a great finished product. Now, some people might be concerned about covering up the Apple logo. I think that's perfectly fine because you want that smooth look of the product. 
So let's take it just like we did before. Now the difference with this is, it's gonna be some, uh, there's some corners on here. See, there's some corners here. So you wanna take a second and make sure you line up that microphone. Make sure the corners are right. And you can kinda use your camera as a guide. If you've got your camera lined up right, this should be a really simple install for you. And you can check it. Remember, you can always pull it off. Now, I've actually got this one lined up perfectly. Because, how do I know? I can see the microphone right here. It may not come across good on the camera, but it is lined up great. So I should be able to pull it right on down, and there it is. Now, it takes a second for this to settle in. But when it settles in, you're going to have a fantastic looking device. It's now wrapped in wood. And thanks to slick wraps, it looks fantastic. Now what some people do is they'll take a rubber band or something like that and apply it around. But it's always like this on curves, guys. Remember that when you're doing something on a curve, you gotta give it that extra little oomph. You gotta be patient with it. It will stick. And once it gets settled in, It'll really adhere to it. You could even heat it up if you wanted to. But if you plan on taking this on and off, you probably don't want to heat it up. As you can see right here in this video, got off camera a little bit, it's already sealing up. That is a great looking scan, guys. Wow, the texture on here, at first it felt a little leathery. Now it actually feels like you're actually touching some kind of soft wood. And I'm just using the authentication logo here to, to get out the little bubbles. Because believe it or not, there are little bubbles in here. And this is this smooth, man. This actually feels, you know, if I didn't know it, I would think this was wood. If I was looking away, just a really good sanded board. Uh, Slickwraps.com. Remember, guys, this is... um fantastic wrap wow I can't believe this one this is this is really nice wow perfectly aligned as you can see as I said before um, on the curves it takes a second but it will adhere down to your advice and it will stick in this phase you can see whether you got it lined up and it's not gonna be perfect but it will come out looking great just like that so I want to tilt a little bit, and bring it down, so you can see how great that looks. Guys, this is the slick wraps for the iPad Air, and this is the dark wood grain. And what I'm also going to do is I'm going to put a link in the description so you can head right over, click over, and get this one. Well worth the purchase, guys. Um, I think if you want to protect your iPad just a little bit <clears throat> and give it a sleek look, well, that's what it's called, slick wraps. That's what they're for, guys. So remember to head over to slickwraps, slickwraps.com, pick up this wood grain in several different other colors. They even have a leather version of this, I believe, over there as well. Not the wood grain, but they do have leather ones. And this will make your iPad look so much different. Oh man, it looks beautiful. All sensors are open, buttons are open. I'll put the screen protector on. You guys have seen me do a screen protector a thousand times, but definitely want to tell you to head over to slickwraps.com. And this is Jay Will. Heading out, guys. Slick Rats for the iPad Air. It's official. See you in the next video, guys.